Hi friends, so today we are doing a beginner's 30 minute full body stretch. Get ready, let's do this. All right, so we're starting off with the upper body and then we're gonna transition to the lower body. We're starting off with the neck by just going side to side. Just slowly. Now onto the shoulders, roll them back, slowly really feel the movement. This entire routine is for beginners, it's just a full body stretch. Now forwards. All right, now extend your arm and cross your body. Push, not too much. You should be feeling it right here. Anything you're doing, any movement you're doing should be enjoyable, it should not be hurting. If it hurts, stop it. <laughs> All right, again, but the other arm. You can look away. Then back, should look like this. Do not pull too much, you don't wanna hurt yourself. Make sure to breathe. Now the other arm.
again on this side. done with the upper body for now. We're just going to roll our hips. Did you hear that pop? Oh my goodness. Just go on to one side. We'll do the other side in a few seconds. Switch it up. Okay, so now bring your leg backwards. Do not bring it to the side like this. This is how I hurt myself when I was in cheerleading. It should be tucked in. You're just trying to uh, stretch out your quad, the front of your leg. Now the other leg. touch the floor. And then onto one side. Pick a side, any side. breathe. 
Now, we're gonna extend our arms. Just to give a little bit of a stretch in your back. Now down, bring your knee down, and just put your hands on your knee, on your front knee, and just let your body stretch, that groin stretch. just you don't need to sit down on your back leg just let the front leg stretch a little bit you can point your toes if you want or not if you're a little bit more flexible you can lean forwards all right on to the other side. Again, the lunge, put one hand down. If you need to put both hands down, go for it. All right, knee down. <sighs> Stretching out the groin again. You can put your foot down if you want. Shoulders back.
extend. Now what you're gonna do is get into a straddle. Whatever you're able to do, make sure it's a comfortable one. And just point and then flex. Keep your shoulders up, point and flex. All right, so now we're just gonna hold on. Uh, no pressure, you're not trying to do the splits here. Just go as far as you can. Don't hurt yourself. Try and keep your back straight too. No need for a hunchback. Great job. And now, a pike position. Shoulders back, point and flex, point and flex. You can also go one and one, which is always fun. And now, again, no pressure. We're not trying to hurt ourselves. Just reach over. Go as far as you can. Now sit back up, cross your leg over, and then extend your arm, put this one back, and then just push. Look away. Now, the other leg. Now what you're gonna do is hug your leg. And now the other leg feels left out, so we hug this one. I hope you're relaxed and breathing and All right, so what we're gonna do next is lay down on your back. You're just gonna lay down for 30 seconds.
Now bring your knee up, just one, and hug. Now just extend your leg and just right behind your knee, just pull a little bit, nothing too, nothing too aggressive, please. Again, bend your knee. We're gonna go outwards. Just let your hips open up a little bit. Now over. Sometimes your back cracks. Make sure to keep your arm extended. All right, let's go to neutral again. Take a 30 second nap. Now bring your knee up. Give it a good hug. Extend your leg, hand behind knee, hands behind knee. Try and keep your, your back on the ground, like flat on the ground.
Now what you're gonna do, just go into a little bit of a, what is it, the cobra? Keep your chest up. Now move backwards. Just extend. Now we're gonna do that all over again. 